What's happening YouTube? My name is Ryan and today on Tricro Studios we're going to be comparing, shooting out if you will, the uh, Gibson Flying V with the Gibson Les Paul. First things first, don't cry people on the internet. These are not, believe it or not, they're not the exact same guitar, okay? Apples versus oranges. I understand, let's put our big boy pants on and we'll get through this together, okay? <laughs> um, yeah, so obviously I know they're not the same guitar. Uh, I don't like to pair the exact same thing together um, I don't know why I like little differences or in this instance extremely heavy differences to very light differences um, they're the exact same pickups uh, tuners are slow or are different these are Cluson these are Grover um, again this is very heavy this is very light so pretty much this is a Gibson Les Paul traditional from 2014. So it's got the 120th anniversary on it. And this is a Flying V Japan from the custom shop. Now when I say from the custom shop, basically what happened was 2015, there was no um, Flying Vs. So they made some like a short run for and like shipped them out to Japan. So when they do that kind of thing, they make it in the custom shop. Um, I find that the lacquer um, in the custom shop is a little different um, than like the lower end kind of deal. Because I've had two different uh, Gibson Flying Vs in the past and if you play these for five minutes, uh, you know, it feels like there's like all of your skin is falling right off on the neck. That is, it kind of happens with the lower end Gibsons, like the studios and stuff like that. Um, I don't know if maybe it's just the solid colors, but uh, where this is uh, sunburst there, vintage sunburst doesn't have it, and this where this is like cherry uh, and a little more expensive doesn't really do that thing. Anyway, uh, let's go ahead and get started here. Pretty much, I'm just gonna play around with some settings. Uh, we're gonna play the exact same thing on this as we do on this, and we're gonna have a tuning test, which I'm a little disappointed. <laughs> Because uh, really traditionally you'd be like, what are you doing? But uh, good job. Anyway, let's go ahead and get started. Thank you. 
right, so there you have it. That is the Flying V versus the Les Paul. Uh, now both of these aren't just the standard models, so it's not. this is not a studio. This is not just a regular Flying V. Mm, doesn't matter. Does it matter? You tell me. Anyway, let me know down below which one you prefer. If you ask me right now, I would say both. Because uh, once I went from one guitar to the other, I was like, wow, give me that one back. Um, just because there's such a, such a difference in it. Anyway, thanks very much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. Please don't forget to subscribe to Tricro Studios. We have a bunch of videos coming at you uh, similar to this and some not so similar to this. Uh, but we always have a video every single Saturday morning. I like to make bonus videos here and there to kind of get you through. I've been Ryan from Tricro Studios. Very happy to own both of these guitars. It's really heavy compared to this. Really? <laughs>